Large grubs like these can often be found inside rotting wood or just under the ground where wood rot has been happening. They, in fact, help to break down fallen branches and tree stumps and debris in forest, and yes, even around your own property. These are the larvae that will become stag or scarab beetles. The larvae live in the ground or rotting wood for about three to five years before becoming adults near the end of their lives. These little grubs were picked up while I was visiting Soldier's Delight. You can see how very well they can strip down the wood. They don't move around a lot. They stay pretty much uh, as larvae in their individual areas. But they help put nutrients back into the ground very quickly and they are vital to our ecosystem. After becoming an adult, these beetles will only live a few months, often between May to August. The adults eat very little, sometimes just tree sap, but often they eat nothing at all and devote their remaining days to mating. Though the male stag beetle has large and formidable mandibles, their actual bite to a human being is not much more than a kind of pinch. To another male, however, the bite can be fatal. Male stag beetles are known to stand up on their hind legs in posturing battle with another male. The female stag beetle is much smaller than the male, and while she appears to be less likely to be a danger, she can in fact inflict a pretty good sting. When I view the armature of stag beetles, close up. It's easy for me to kind of see where historical warriors might have gotten their ideas for their armor. Magnificent. Believe it or not, the habitats that support stag beetles is declining in many areas of the world and they are seldom now, if ever, even seen in Great Britain. Since these beautiful animals support soil and decay growth, they are seen as becoming endangered even here in the United States. Rather than destroy them when you see them near your garden, it is both wiser and kinder to simply move them a safer distance from your plants. Or if you keep a wood pile, move the wood pile further from your garden. Scarab beetles come in many different sizes and many different colors. And in fact, they're frequently used as the ideas or icons behind lots of jewelry that women wear. I found this one on my deck. When I do see these, I'm reminded of the uh, sacred scarabs from Egypt. Of course, those were a whole lot larger, and if you watched The Mummy, a whole lot more dangerous. The ones in our area are just beautiful to watch. <laughs>